great morning, great morning, great morning. Let's go. Hey, this is Wesley, billion dollar virgin. Real quickly here, I want to talk about how to increase your confidence about yourself, okay? Guys, jump in here. Put your names below. I want you to jump in here right now. Let's go! Motivated! Dedicated! Let's go! Now, listen. I know some of you right now think I'm insane, okay? But question for you. How many of you got out of your bed like that? How many of you got out of your bed, out of your home, out of your apartment, ready to conquer your world, to be rich, successful, or whatever? Maybe zero. Real quickly here, look at me. I want to share with you how to raise your self-confidence, how to raise the self-esteem, how to raise your self-image. I want everybody right now to come at the word self-image. And I'm going to define it for you. Listen to me here. Self-image is how you feel about yourself, okay? How do you feel about yourself? Like when you look at yourself in the mirror, what do you see? What do you say to yourself? See, so many of you want money, right? You're like, Wesley, give me the gift card. I want the money. A lot of you want the money. I want the money. But many of you are not able to handle once the money is deposited in your bank account. Let me give you a story. There was this young man a couple of years ago. He followed me on social media in his 20s, right? And the thing about contacting me on social media, I get a thousand messages a day, right? And I make people work for it, okay? It's what I do personally because I get so many people reaching out to me, Wesley, can you help me? Wesley, I'm starving. Wesley, I'm hurt. Wesley, I'm depressed. And I want to see how bad you want it. So this young man, he will reach out to me every day. Wesley, I want to work with you. Wesley, what do I need to do? Wesley, I'm ready to do this. My life is jacked up. I am broke and I need to make money. So for about six months, consistently, this young man reached out to me and I finally gave him a book. And I gave him a couple of videos on my website at WesleyVirgin.com. I said, listen, watch this. And that's it. He said, Wesley, he came back to me the next day. Wesley, I watched it. I said, come here, watch it again. Long story short, after watching all my videos, changing his mindset, he made a million. But listen, when he made a million bucks, you know what he told me because he came to one of my seminars in Vegas. He said, Wesley, I'm earning $300,000 a month and I'm depressed. Listen, this is for everybody that thinks money is going to change your life. Yes, it will allow you to do some fun stuff. Travel the world, pop in bottles, buy some jewelry here, right? Buy some nice cars and homes. But this young man in his 20s, if you're in your 20s, I want you to listen close. He said, I'm depressed. And I'm thinking to myself, okay, why? He said, I'm drinking too much. And, you know, I was partying. And, you know, all the things that I wanted to do because I saw you doing those things, you know, I wanted to do too. You know, I wanted to hang out and fly around the world first class, and I did it. I wanted to buy the nice, you know, AP watches, and I did it. But now I'm depressed. I'm making $300,000 per month and I'm depressed. And let me tell you why he was depressed. Because the money that he was making, listen, was not congruent with his self image. Okay, let me say it again. The money, like some of you make $20,000 a year, $30,000 a year, $50,000, $100,000. Some of you make that per month. Whatever your self-image is, whatever you feel that your cap is in life, what you're worthy of, 
It doesn't matter if you make 300000 per month, you will sabotage it. I've seen it happen over and over again. He came to my seminar and I said, young man, look at me. Now you realize it's not about the money. You thought that your happiness was inside of the money. It made you happy for a moment, didn't it? It made you smile for a moment, didn't it? He said, yeah. What you need to find is a purpose. And then you need to raise your own self-image about yourself. Now the question is, how do you do that, right? Okay, this is gold. Hit the like button if this is gold right now. Hit the like button, comment in the chat. I'm about to show you right now how you, I don't care if you're broke, I don't care if you're earning 10,000 a month, you wanna earn more, I don't care if you had a deadbeat job and you wanna leave that job, this will work, okay? I've been doing this for the last seven years and I'm a multi-millionaire and I say that very humbly here. I gotta get ready to go to the gym so I gotta make this quick. I want you right now, I'm looking at you, big head, I want you to stand up for me. I want you to stand up for me, you right now. I don't care where, you, you could be driving the car, pull over. If you're on the toilet right now taking a dump, wipe yourself and get up. If you're in the bed right now, get up. If you're at work, go to the bathroom, take a break. Because for the next two minutes, I'm going to show you how to raise your self-image, how to raise your self-esteem, how to raise your confidence so you don't sabotage yourself once you make money, okay? Once you make money. Understand something about money. Money is a byproduct of your actions, period. Good people make money. Bad people make money. Pretty people make money. Ugly people make money, okay? It's only a byproduct of your actions, period. But the question is, what do you think about yourself today? How do you feel about yourself? Do you see yourself as a king, a queen? I talk about this all the time. I want you to do this with me, okay? Stand up. Stand up. I'm talking to you. Yeah, with your big ass eyes. Stand up! Get up! I'm standing up. And I'm a multi-millionaire here. Because the thing is, what we're about to do is speak to ourselves. Talk to yourself. You cannot lay in your bed or sit down or be in a dormant state and expect things to change. Stand up. And what I want you to do is this. I want you to go to a mirror, okay? Go find your mirror right now. Go ahead, everybody. I don't care if it's a bathroom mirror. I don't care if it's your makeup mirror as well, okay? And all I want you to do is look at yourself. And I want you to look in your eyes. As you're sitting there listening to my voice, I want you to look at yourself for the very first time, and I want you to say, Wesley Virgin, you knock on the mirror. I don't know what mirror you're knocking on. I want you to say your name, Wesley Virgin, whatever your name is. You are amazing. Now, why is that important? Let me tell you why. Because, see, when Wesley Virgin was growing up, my mama and my daddy never told me they loved me. They never gave me hugs. They never said I was amazing. They never said I was great. And I'm not blaming them. They didn't know. And a lot of you that's listening to my voice right now have experienced that. You didn't have a parent that told you who you are. You didn't have a parent to say, you know what, good morning, King. You didn't have a parent to say, good morning, Queen. You didn't have a parent that says, hey, you know what? You're going to be very successful in the future. You know what? You are great right now. You know what? You are very intelligent. You know what? You are cut up. Am I making sense? Wesley Virgin, you're great. I want everybody to say it about yourself. Say it below. Comment in the chat below. Wesley Virgin, I love you. 
Wesley Virgin, you are amazing. Wesley Virgin, you are successful. Wesley Virgin, you are outstanding. Wesley Virgin, you are intelligent. Wesley Virgin, you are beautiful. Wesley Virgin, you are a god. Wesley Virgin, you are powerful. Wesley Virgin, you are a lion. Wesley Virgin, you are successful. Wesley Virgin, you are outstanding. Wesley Virgin, you are amazing. I want all of you right now to do it. I want all of you right now to do it. I don't care if you have tears in your eyes. I know this is hard. The first time I did this, this was difficult. I could not look at myself and tell myself who I was. But this is the inception stages of wealth. It's the inception stages of happiness. This is where it all begins. It all begins with you. Some of you are thinking right now, well, Wesley, I don't feel like I'm the best. Wesley, I don't feel like I'm smart. Wesley, I don't feel like I'm pretty. Wesley, I don't feel like I'm going to be successful. I don't believe I'm a million. I'm saying these things, but I don't believe it. It doesn't matter. Repetition is the mother of skill. Get up every morning. It doesn't matter how you feel. It doesn't matter what you want to do. As long as you do it. Sometimes, folks, you got to fight through the pain. Some of you, you know, when you do this, when I have people, when I coach them, I have them look at themselves in the mirror. You know how many people cannot look at themselves and tell themselves in their eyes that they're amazing, that they, they love themselves. Tears streaming down their eyes because they've never faced the person that they've been running away from. Now, why is this important? Let me tell you why. Because, see, you got to be impervious. You got to be impervious to the outside world. Because every day when you leave your home, every day when you go to school, when you go to that job, somebody's going to tell you the opposite of what you currently believe. Somebody's going to call you a loser. Somebody's going to call you stupid. Somebody's going to call you silly. Somebody's going to say you're never making in life. Some people are going to call you a character. Some people are going to say you're insane. Some people are going to say you're not smart enough. Somebody's going to call you ugly. Somebody's going to say you're unattractive. Somebody's going to say you're too short. Somebody's going to say that you're outrageous. But you, it's your responsibility, young people. I'm talking to you from the top of my heart. It is your responsibility every single morning, every day before you begin your day, to tell yourself who you are until that sinks in. Until one day you start to walk better. Come on. One day you'll roll your shoulders back. Your chest will be out. You'll start to walk with your head up, not with your head down. You'll start to dress better. You'll start to communicate better. You'll start to take care of different areas of your life physically, emotionally, spiritually. And guess what? Now, you'll soon become the person that is destined for greatness. See, the thing is, we were born for greatness, but we're not destined for greatness. Which means is when God created you, if you believe that, you were born to be the best version of yourself. God, the universe, wants you to be your best, but you must cultivate that. How do we cultivate things? You have to get up. I don't care if you're sleeping in the air mattress. I don't care if you're sleeping on the floor. I don't care if you're sleeping under a bridge. I don't care if you're in a situation that you have no way out. In the morning, throughout your day, tell yourself that you're successful. Tell yourself that you're great. Tell yourself that you're a king. Tell yourself that you're a queen. And say it with conviction. Say it with conviction. A lot of you right now, when you talk to yourself, oh, you're you're a queen, you're you're a king, You're, you're amazing. Wesley Virgin, you know, I love you. Wesley Virgin, I love you! I want you to say it just as if you were having an argument with a person, okay? You have an argument with a person, right? And you're going back and forth with them. And some of you get so mad, you get so passionate, 
and say, I hate you. I can't stand you. You did this to me. Why did you hurt me? Why did you do that? Why did you lie? I want you to take that same passion, that same conviction, and I want you to switch it. I want you to reframe it, and I want you to direct it to yourself. I want you to tell yourself that you love yourself. Tell yourself that you are rich. I want you to tell yourself that you are wealthy. Tell yourself that you are smart. Tell yourself that you are intelligent. I love you guys. That's it. I'm done. I got to go to the gym. I love all of you. I love all of you. I'm going to give you some money. I I love all of you. I love you. That's how you raise your self-esteem. That's how you raise your confidence. Confidence is not a now. Confidence is not something that you get. It's a process of thinking. You want to have more confidence to do things in life? You have to start speaking to yourself. You got to speak life into yourself. I love you. Hit the like and share button right now. If right now, today, while you're watching this video, you're going to watch it again. And you're going to do everything I did. I did this when I was broke. I did this when I had no car. I did this when I had... When I had to move out of my apartment, I did this when I had to file bankruptcy. I did this when I was in a jail cell by myself. I did this when my parents said, what are we going to do with Wesley? I did this when my friends told me that, Wesley, you just can't get it together. I did this when the world was telling me that I would never amount to anything. I did this when they kicked me out of the army and the army said, Wesley, you're no good. You can't listen Authority, we're trying to tell you what to do. You're rebellious. You'll never amount to anything. Get your life together. And guess what? I still made it. I still made it. All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. I still made it. Listen to me. I still did it. Still made millions. Still became wealthy. Helping people like you. Why? Because every day, it's my responsibility to tell Wesley Virgin who he is. Because when I leave this house to go to the gym, people are going to see me. I'm going to see people at the gym. I'm going to see. It's always somebody may say, hey, man, I don't like what you do. Hey, well, why do you scream so much? Well, I don't like how you did. When you scamming me, right? Are you crazy? What? <laughs> every day. Somebody may, and they will tell you who you are. It's up to you to begin your day, throughout your day, to create the person that you want to become. See, in life, when I had to tell that young man I was making 300000 per month, like imagine that. I said, it's not about the things that you get. It's not about the things that you acquire. It's about the person you become in the process. See, I know you think it's, it's, it's about the lovely jewelry, the traveling the world. That's great. But it's really about like everything that we're doing right now. Like this is a task, right? Talking to yourself, telling yourself how amazing you are. You're not really doing it for the money. You're doing it because you must become the type of person to attract the money. That's how it works. This is why I get so many opportunities. This is why people love me so much. You know why? Because I love myself. And people can feel that I love myself. And when I love myself, people want to get close to people like that. Because most of you don't. I love you. I started to do this online, do these type of videos that I post at WesleyVirgin.com because I understood a some, I understood one thing about people, that people need someone to believe in them until their belief kicks in. I want to help you believe in yourself because I believe in you. If I didn't believe in you, I wouldn't do this. I know everybody that's watching me is not going to be rich. I know everybody that's watching me is not going to take action. I understand that. But I'm looking for the one, the two, 
that this message resonates with. And they're going to just do it. They're going to get a mirror and say, hey, I'm, I'm amazing. I'm great. It doesn't mean that you're going to do it like I, I did it. But you're going to get better. And as you start to get better, you're going to start feeling better. Even though you're not successful, you're going to tell yourself that you're successful every day. You're successful. You're a multimillionaire. You're rich. You're amazing. You're awesome. You're powerful. You're a fucking lion, Wes. You are a king, Wes. You are fearless, Wes. You're going to repeat those things. I love you guys so much. I appreciate you. Here's the card. You need $25. Here's the card. Here's the card. I want everybody right now to come at the word, let's go. And I want you, I'm asking you, and I'm suggesting that you share this right now and like this. Share it and like it. This is about self-image. It's about increasing your self-image in life. Okay? Put money to the side for a second. Your self-image, how you feel about yourself. What you feel that you're worthy of. Here you go. If you're going to do what I just showed you in this video and watch this video again, I want you to come at the words, let's go. If you're going to do this for the next 30 days, tell yourself that you're successful. Tell yourself that you are great. Understand this before I let you go. No one on the planet is great in the beginning. Some of you want to be great today and you want to get those type of results. Greatness starts with you speaking it. You know what? I'm great. It doesn't matter if people say, no, you're not great. You have no money in your bank account. I'm successful. You're not successful. You can't even pay your bills on time. So what? Everything in life that you see all these amazing people become, LeBron James, Kobe Bryant, Tiger Woods, Oprah Winfrey, Kevin Hart, Ellen DeGeneres, all these amazing people that we see on TV, Kim Kardashian, they had to, with themselves, tell themselves who they were. And once they convinced themselves, then the world was convinced. I couldn't be Wesley Billion Dollar Virgin until I convinced Wesley Billion Dollar Virgin I was him. No one would believe me until I believed it for myself. You got to believe it for yourself. You got to keep speaking to yourself. It may not happen day one, day two, month one, month two. But the more you speak it, one day you'll believe it. I love you guys so much. Thank you for sharing and liking this video here. You're amazing. I love you. Here's the card here. Go ahead and screenshot that. First person that screenshots this and uses this card is yours. You should do it real quickly. Please share and like this video. I'm giving you money. I'm asking you, I'm suggesting for you now to realize that you should share and like this video. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. You can use this on my website. You can use this to buy self-help books, um, Amazon.com. I would use this for self-development literature because books really help me to become the person that I am today. I'm obsessive about reading. I do promote that you read as much as humanly possible in the areas of self-development and the areas of self-help to help you. Understand this, my great teacher by the name of Jim Rohn, he said this, I didn't meet him formally, but he says that if you work on you more than you work on your job, you'll be successful. If you work on yourself, you, your attitude, your personality, how you feel, your self-image, your confidence, how you dress, how you speak, how you communicate. If you work on yourself more, you'll be a very successful human being. I love you so much. I appreciate you. If you got the card, please hit the like and share button. This is Wesley Bill United Virgin. Mom!